all the amazing parents out there please subscribe to our channel mama baby world when we become parent for the first time there are many small small things which confuses us a lot and one such thing is when should we start giving water to our baby should we start giving him water just after his birth or should we wait for some time how we will come to know if he is taking enough water what are the signs that our baby is getting dehydrated does giving excess of water cause any damage in the long run hi this is manya and welcome to mama baby world in today's video we will be discussing about everything that you need to know about giving water to your baby i'll be breaking down this video into three segments first when i'll be talking about the babies of the age 0 to 6 months then when the age of the baby is from 6 to 12 month and then when the baby is more than 1 year old now when the baby is of the age 0 to 6 month he mostly depends upon the mother's milk now mother's milk in itself is a complete food it contains all the nutrients which are required by the baby as well as it contains enough water right so we do not need to give any additional water to the baby be it any season be it winters be it summers you need not to give any extra water if you feel it's actually very dry outside and he might be feeling dehydrated you can increase the number of feeds you are giving to him but need not to give any additional water because if you are giving some additional water it will cause a damage to him in the long run his body will not be able to absorb the nutrients properly as well as the kidneys of the baby they are not that mature they are not able to handle that much of a water so we should not provide any extra water to the baby if you are giving him the formula milk if your baby depends upon the formula milk read the instruction written on the bottle carefully on the packet carefully and mix the feed accordingly don't mix it in excess water or don't mix it in the little amount of water just mix it properly because if you are going to add too much water again he will not get proper nutrition and if you are adding very little amount of water his body will get dehydrated and he might even get constipated so just read the instructions carefully and according to that mix the water in your feed now after 6 months the baby start taking solids from the age 5 to 6 months we start giving some solids to the baby and that is the time when we should introduce water also right he will not take too much of a water he will hardly take one or two sips two three times a day but that is more than enough for him Uh, apart from giving water directly you can even try to give him some fruits which has very high water content like there are musk melon there are watermelons which have very high water content and if you are giving him fruit juices you can mix water into it you can dilute the fruit juices like you are taking one part of fruit juice and you can add at least four to five part of water into it so that will also help him to fulfill his water requirements right but it's not necessary that he will take too much water from the age 6 to 12 months he will just take few sips you can put that water in his uh, milk bottle only and give him few sips at least two three times a day but make sure that you first boil the water cool it down to normal room temperature and then give it to him there shouldn't be any bacteria or germs into it it should be properly boiled cool down to the normal temperature and then give it even in summers don't try to give him the cold water right give him a water at a normal temperature or you can give him a lukewarm water when the baby gets a little older like 1 plus year he automatically shows the sign that yeah now i am feeling thirsty like my garvin whenever he feels thirsty he goes near the water can and then i give him uh, water i give him water from the normal small glasses he will take two three sips from that he will not uh, drink too much water in one go but his frequency of taking water has increased so apart from that i also give him few sips of lukewarm water in the morning because lukewarm water increases the metabolism he just wakes up and it's also good for his motions so that's why i always give at least two three sips of lukewarm water in the morning and apart from that we can also introduce uh, tender coconut water because they have lots of ions which are good for the body so yeah that's all about these things right now uh so your baby will do well 
just follow your instincts you will understand when he is feeling thirsty and one more thing i want to tell you how to know that your baby is getting dehydrated now one best sign is he should urinate properly he should pass his urine properly there should not be any smell it should not be very dark colored it should be diluted and there shouldn't be any pungent smell in it and other thing is if he is feeling dehydrated his lips will start getting dry and when he will cry there won't be any tears because these are very small things but his body will try to conserve as much as water possible and there will be problem when he is going uh, he is passing the stool so these are all the signs which shows that uh, he is getting dehydrated the lips actually get very dry if he is getting dehydrated so follow these signs and you will understand that what are the requirements of your baby so yeah that's all about the video the things which which we discussed were that from the 0 to 6 months we need not to give him any water from 6 to 12 months you can give him few sips of water or you can introduce the uh, fruits which has very high water content or you can uh, also give him diluted fruit juices from 12 months he will actually start showing the signs that yeah now i am thirsty he will take two three sips but they those will be enough for him So yeah that's all about the video i think you like uh, you will like it and it will be uh, informative for you if you like this video please hit that like button and please subscribe to my channel let's make it a big family bye